So I don't think the setup's really gonna get any better than this. Uh, the only thing I could think of is maybe to wait to, to peace out with France uh, and then go to war with America, but uh, that's gonna take too long. I, I'm, I'm, I'm impatient. And actually, I let it turn pass by, and just like we thought, America was sending a second fleet uh, down to nor northern Brazil. So we're going to start this war up right now. We're going to go right now. So here we go. Let's try our best here. I realized that uh, I wanted to kind of save nukes to nuke Miami, Washington, and New York, but I actually cannot nuke New York because uh, there is one small Canadian tile here. Uh, if I if I nuke New York, that'll reach out into southern Toronto, and then I'll have to go to war with Canada as well. And I really do not want to face Canada also. Uh, so let's try to avoid that scenario, right? Yeah, let's try that. Okay, so let's go ahead and give themselves our, ourselves a little uh, welcome to uh, Barack Obama. Bam, throw that down right there. I definitely want to nuke Miami too to get rid of all of those units uh, in Florida. So let's go ahead and make sure that we use one there. So we're down to five in Madrid at least. Now I need to be careful. I don't want to do, I don't want to do it here right straight on Miami. I want to do it here. Uh, that way we don't you know, ruin the relationship that we have with Cuba. We also need to make sure that we destroy the American Los Angeles. I actually have another... That's right. I, I, I managed to actually grab the atomic bomb and, and the one that's located on the carrier in Cuba is going to be uh, sent towards Washington, D.C. as well. So we'll do that right there. Boom. So there's a couple of submarines that are chilling around. We need to be very careful with those. Um, let's see here. I know that the missile cruisers just do an excellent job against these uh, submarines. So let's make sure that we use those missile cruisers for that. Where's another one at? Uh, the other one's all the way up this way. I, I Dang it. I knew I should have built missile cruisers. You guys were telling me, build more missile cruisers. I love battleships, though. I understand in this mod that they're like, missile cruisers are probably better, but I do really like the battleships. So this destroyer technically has a front row shot on Washington, D.C. Uh, I don't know if... I don't know if we're going to use him yet, though. I might need he might need to wait, like, one more turn. Oh, here we go. Let's use... Maybe I shouldn't use this submarine. Yeah, I'm going to move the destroyer in a little bit closer just to get more vision. Do I have a battleship somewhere around? Here we go. Bam. So I'm actually going to send my submarine down south here. Oh, here we go. Here's a missile cruiser. And actually, this is perfect. Well, no, not yet. Hold on. Let me try to get a little bit more vision. Uh, I need to try to protect my caravan. All right, so let's try to destroy their destroyer, or their carrier, I'm sorry. That's actually even more important than destroying their own submarines. That way, you know, less aircrafts to deal with, because that's going to be an issue. So this carrier is done. I don't know what we're going to do with him, but I guess I'll send him back this way. Okay, so I think we're going to need to nuke Washington at least one more time. At least one more time. Man, this is getting tough. I really don't want to have to nuke it for two times, but if I need to, then I need to. Let's try it. Where, where are they at now? That is still not going to be enough. I might need to do one more nuke. Uh, I mean, I'm not, I don't need to save it for anything else, right? Well, let's nuke Miami first. I've already done some pretty major damage to, to Washington, D.C. Let's, let's nuke uh, Miami again. And then hopefully that brings that down. Well, actually, they've got the same, essentially, they've got the same defense, so that might not help out. Nuking Miami again probably will kind of lead to the same results. I'm going to nuke Washington one more time so we can walk in there. Oh, crap. Are you kidding me? I can't take it, I can't take it over? Oh, that's, that's terrible. That is not good. I cannot use that many. I guess I'll wait one more turn then. Oh, dang, that's terrible. All right, well, let's use another missile crew. Let's use another missile, uh, nuclear missile here on Miami. And I'm imagining the same results since it has the same defense. Yeah, the same thing. We still have kind of delivered a pretty heavy blow to the Americans, though. Ah, I, I, oh my gosh, this is, this sucks. Um, oh yeah, Tanzania is not happy. Chile is not happy, that's fine. These are the only city-states that are friendly with, but I'm hoping my city-states will kind of counteract uh, that sort of thing. Uh, let's, I think we're going to have to leave the Eastern Front against the U.S. alone for now. Dang. That's crazy. How is that defense so high? All right, well, anyways, let's go ahead and attack uh, Alaska. Let's attack Alaska here. So we should be able to drop that right right there. I'm hoping this is going to be good enough, right? Or are we seeing the same thing? Yeah, that's still a, a lot. I mean, but this is a little bit different, though. We can get two melee attacks. Uh, I mean, that's that's about it. I mean, we, Two range attacks, though. Two melee attacks. Oh, I can get a stealth bomber. That's right. How are these, how are these guys going to do? Not bad. Not bad. We don't have vision. That's the problem. 
Okay, well, let's move a battleship somewhere close in range. Actually, you know, let's move the sub... Oh, the submarine can't move anymore. Let's move this guy in range so we can get some more visibility. I'll probably have to back him up, though. Let's see how much damage the stealth bomber can do. Not that much. Clearly not that much. Okay, well, let's... For the, for the next... Let's just make sure that we take care of everything in the Pacific. Let's take care of everything here. I might need to send a bunch of things up towards Anchorage. I guess we'll do that. Well, let's see. Let's send this missile cruiser to try to find ourselves a little bit more American submarines. Ooh! Okay, I'm so glad that I, I, I put this vision. I, I put this missile cruiser closer to Seattle and Los Angeles because I would have pulled myself into a war with Canada. I need to be really, really careful with that. Just randomly, you know, nuking the Americans is a bad idea because I do not want to also have to fight the Canadians at the same time. That is not going to go well. So, yeah, you know what? The plan is to focus on Anchorage for now. So I, will, I, won't, even, I won't even worry about every, anything else. We're going to focus on Anchorage. I do need to be careful. I don't see nuclear activity or nuclear weapons at all in Seattle, so that's good. I guess I'll save my own nuclear weapons. I might as well not nuke it again, right? We're going to see the same problem no matter what, and that is just crazy high city defense. All right, we're gonna have to go to we're gonna have to go to the next turn. We still have over a we have one missile cruiser. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, miss, nuclear missile. Why do I why am I calling them missile missile cruisers? Uh, so we have we can utilize a few of them, and I have a few more coming. Yeah, oh, I've got three more coming next turn, so that's good. That's really good. So I'm gonna see exactly where Washington D.C.'s health goes in the next turn, and then we'll kind of address the situation from there. Now, those three nukes that are being built, I can't use them the next turn. I can set them up to be used two turns from now. Uh, all right, so I had a missile cruiser destroyed and a submarine destroyed. This would actually be really good to maybe nuke Washington again. Maybe I should have saved some of those nukes and let them continue to kind of build up units. I'm guessing they're coming from Denver and Chicago and Houston, Phoenix. Uh, maybe I should have saved them and just slowly pounded away at all these units Maybe a good idea. I had no idea what I was jumping into. I'm just glad that so far I'm not at war with Canada. At so far, at least. So where did those units die? Were they were they killed in the Pacific? Yeah, one was definitely killed in the Pacific. The other one, I'm I'm guessing maybe both of them in the Pacific. Possibly, or maybe you know what? I think one of them. I think they're both. The submarine was in the in the Atlantic. I'm 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 assuming India is now an ally of of, of Italy. Uh, no, I don't like that. I don't like that. I've got 101 uh, happiness, though. That's pretty nice. I cannot believe this city defense. I've never had. I've never seen something like this before. It especially sucks because I can't use my air force. If my air force was here, I'd you know be in much better luck. But I, they are nowhere even close to this area. So needless to say, that's a big problem. Let's move in some units. Maybe we try to use the stealth bomber again. Wait a second. I don't have the vision. Um, well, let's figure out what we're going to do about Washington, D.C. first. So one more nuke. I should nuke this, needless to say, just to, just to nuke it, just to destroy all those units. So I think I'll do that. Uh, we will do that once more. Okay, so we're going to destroy all these units, and I'm hoping that'll bring down Washington's pretty low. I'm hoping at least enough where I can do a few more battleship attacks, and that'll bring it down to really low. Because it needs to be at pretty much zero. That's what I'm. That's what I'm realizing right now. Oh, I don't want to be b bombarded by Miami. Yeah, we need to nuke Miami anyway, so just to get rid of those units. Okay, so I'm down to uh, no more nukes in Western Europe. We're gonna destroy all these units, not so just so we don't have to deal with them. And I can move. I might get bombarded here. Actually, you know what? No, what I can do is I can just move here. And then attack like this. Boom. Now the destroyer should be able to take it. Bam, Washington, D.C. is ours. Perfect. All right, so let's... Uh, I'm going to annex it, because why not? And then let's move in towards Miami. We've got a few more ranged troops, ranged naval units that we can utilize here. Battleship, battleship. I like it. Here's a destroyer that we can utilize, but we're not going to use it yet, I don't think. Yeah, no, we don't want to use it yet. We've got to stay, this needs to be a very, this is a very, very important front that we protect against. I, uh, you know what? This carrier is just going to sacrifice himself just to get some vision. I know he's probably going to get destroyed. That's fine. I just want to, I want to get some vision here. All right, so here's another missile cruiser. I'm going to send him down south. 
Maybe to help out. Actually, can he attack now? <gasps> he can. Ooh. I I don't know if I want to risk destroying one of my destroyers to take over. I could probably risk both of these destroyer units to take over Miami, but that's a big risk because I'm I'm you, you're talking about losing one for sure, potentially losing two. I think I I think I why yeah why why take that risk? Let's not do that. That's stupid. Drew, don't be stupid. Do stealth bombers have an extra extra range? They actually do have a bit extra range, but I don't think it's enough. Oh yeah, certainly not enough. Well, maybe it is. Let's let's send it down to Madrid. And okay, so France again, they are going to be a thorn in our side, just like we thought. It is nearing. I think we're getting closer and closer to being able to piece them out. Four turns away. Okay, I'd like that to be a little bit better, but okay, that's fine. Four turns is four turns. Clean that stuff up. Everyone else just chill. And you're going to go to Madrid because we're not done with you. And let's get some extra culture. Yeah. Who cares about tourism? We've got the Great Firewall. All right. Yeah. So, and we're like, you know, like we said, we're just going to have to pound away at Anchorage. I don't want to, uh, should I use one more? How many more do I still have? I still have, I have two more. I'd like to save one for Los Angeles and the other for Seattle. I've got more coming though. That's something to keep in mind. I do have more coming. Taking over Anchorage would be cool. I don't I, I don't know if I'd be able to take it over though. Like take it over right now. It, yeah, that'd be nice. Alright, I'm gonna take the risk and I'm gonna do it. We're gonna attack here. That was risky. That's really risky. I had no vision. There could have been some Canadian units uh caught in the crossfire. That's really good that that did not happen. That could have been really stupid of me. Alright, let's try to take this over. This is why I want to take it over. Because I knew they had a lot of air force, a large amount of air force units. Uh, but we're not gonna be able to, huh? I don't think we will. Oh man, that that's that is unfortunate. I I don't want to waste these destroyers here because they'll just they'll just you know die. Let's send these guys up this way. I mean, I could back up and nuke it one more time, like we did Washington D.C., just to save a bunch of nukes for it. But I don't know if that's good. I don't know if that's that's not efficient. That's not good. I shouldn't be using those types of strategies at all. Okay, so yeah, we're going to send definitely all of these towards Madrid. Uh, yeah, you fix that, and yeah, you go towards Madrid too. Stealth Bomber. Okay, well, there we go. We can use this guy. And I think I have a Jet Bomber that I can use next time. So yeah, I think we might be able to take Anchorage over without use, without wasting a nuke, which would be awesome. And yeah, we're just going to continue to build these because I realize that, uh, that, yeah, I mean, nuclear missiles don't really do much. Not at all. They totally don't do much against the Americans. They must have, like, I don't know. They must have bomb shelters and stuff like that all over the place. Yeah, no, 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 just third. I mean, if it's only going to take, like, 11, 13 turns, that's not bad. There's only one more technology for us to grab. We'll get the monument. I got to try to defend Washington here. It's very, very important that I defend that. I don't want anyone to take that from me. Let's give it extra range. We could use that. And who else can we can... Uh, oh, I didn't think about this. And I also need to be weary that I might possibly get nuked. And that's fine if I do. I just need to kind of be weary of that, looking around, seeing if I see any fallout in my lands, because that would be a problem. Okay, so we have a spy that's been kicked out of Washington. That's fine. We'll move you inside of uh, Denver. Let's go to Denver. Don't really know why. Yeah, and India stole away. That sucks. Okay, so boom. Hey, I mean, we accomplished our goal. We did take over Washington, but I'm not I'm nowhere near done with this campaign. This campaign is very, very. Uh, this is tough. This is not easy. I took over. I took over Washington D.C., but that is certainly not enough. All right, so let's cross our fingers and hope that they don't bring too many troops over this way. I'm hoping that we did enough. Oh, did they take it back? Yep, they did. They took it back just like that. And I just got a whole bunch of units destroyed. This is going to be messy. This is going to be really, really messy. Well, the good thing is, you know, taking back Washington is they destroyed a lot of their own, uh, they, they destroyed, you know, their, their city's defense. So that's pretty nice. I guess we'll focus on Miami, even though they're going to take it back. Well, I am now rethinking this strategy. I mean, here's the positive part is that so far I've done some pretty good damage to the Americans so far. Uh, just nuking them itself takes took away so much, you know, uh, population, which is nice. And that's that's going to do a number on, you know, everything. Uh, science production, culture, everything. 
so that that in itself was useful. The problem is that I don't think we're ready for this. I don't know if we can do this. Uh, I'd like rationalism for extra science. Let's go rationalism here, I think. What, what does co finishing commerce do for me? Uh, I don't really care about that. Let's go rationalism. We could use extra science, even though uh, it, doesn't, it doesn't matter. I probably could have gone for some... There's nothing There's nothing really anymore that, that can really use... That, that could be useful for me in terms of social policy, so that's fine. All right, so we've finished a battleship. Let's make sure that we do maybe a missile cruiser now. Okay, get your get your over here. Get you get you over here. Let's see what do we got. So we should have. Let's try to take over Anchorage. That would be a big positive. If we could peace out for at least Alaska, that would be amazing. It'd be really really cool. So we had one we have one stealth bomber attack, and, and just yeah, Anchorage is a good s spot because now we can send our air force over this right with this way, and then we can attack Seattle from Anchorage from Alaska, Anchorage Alaska. So that would be cool. I never thought about that strategy. But it is, it's certainly coming to mind that I might need to peace out here. Well, I can't peace out yet because there, there's, there's a limit. I like Miami, but dang. I don't know if we could take it over. I'm going to leave Washington alone. Let's just try to take over Miami for now. Wait a second, where's the destroyer units at? I've had destroyer units destroyed. I'm having destroyer units destroyed. What is up with that? Hmm. Okay, I'm going to put you in range. I know, they're going to take back Miami. But at least we destroy a lot of their buildings in the process, and, you know, good stuff happens. Still nothing? Are you kidding me? Uh, I don't want to take that risk, but I might have to. Or I could nuke it and destroy, all, like, all their units. And certainly take it over. Ah. Uh. Okay, let's do it. At least if I could hold on to a city, even if I don't hold on to Florida or Washington D.C., it'd be excellent. I might actually, you know, I'd destroy my own unit there. Let's let's go. Uh, I'd get into war with Amer uh, Mexico. Hmm. Oh, this is not good. I might destroy my own unit here. That would be messy. Well, maybe I wait. I think that's what I'm going to do. I think I might wait. And also, let's continue to try to destroy some units here and there. Can I take over Anchorage? That would be one big success. Uh, I don't know, actually. It does not look like it. I don't know if I can take it over without sacrificing battleships. Oop, and I did sacrifice two battleships, but it worked out. I think that's what I'm going to have to do. And we'll try to see if we can keep it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to sacrifice my battleships here. I'm sorry, uh, destroyers. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. So we sacrifice him. Oh, he didn't die. That was cool. And uh, we do the same thing with this guy. We should be able to take it over now. Bam, get some extra gold from it too. That's nice. The problem is that they're going to retake it. But will they retake Alaska? That's, that's the question. If I can hold on to Alaska, then I could probably make a straight up, just a, a front going... Entirely from the west to the east of America. That might not be terrible. Ooh, definitely was not prepared for this. Was not prepared for this. All right, guys, I'm going to have to stop right there, though. We have to think of a few things. Oh, man, that mobile Sam's probably going to take back Anchorage, and that's not good because I don't have any more destroyer units. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.